Hello, this is Annalisa from Faith Dream Green, and welcome back to my channel. You're watching my fall card series for 2021. I'll be using this stamp set from The Rabbit Hole Designs. This is the Caffeinated Kangaroo, and you also saw a Lawn Fawn stamp set. That is the Jump for Joy stamp set, and you will see what I do with that in a little bit. But first, I'm going to be creating my background with some Distress Oxide inks. So there is the grass, and I am doing a slimline card. So creating the background for the scene. And so I'm going to be creating the sky now, giving it that fall vibe, a fall sunset with some yellows and reds, giving it that fall festive cozy feel. So essentially I'm going to make this kangaroo into a fall scene. It is going to be jumping into some leaves and that is where the Lawn Fun Jump for Joy stamp set is going to come into play. I am going to use the leaves from that and make a big leaf pile. So as I get this background all ready, I didn't want it to be too vibrant and just a little bit because I'm going to be putting the pieces on top. Then I'm just doing some splatter with the water because it gives it that, takes it that extra mile, brings the color to life on the paper, I think. I just love to watch this. It's like my favorite. You take a color and you just add so much life to it with the water. So then I'm going to go ahead and dab that off and just make sure that that's dry. And I'll actually set this aside to dry for a little bit and then work on the next pieces. So I'm going to ink up the kangaroo and get that colored. So I'm going to be using Memento Tuxedo Black ink. That is my go-to ink for Copic coloring or Spectrum Noir coloring. I only have a few Copic colors in my collection, but I have Spectrum Noir markers that are alcohol-based and I love using the Memento Tuxedo Black ink for this. There is other inks out there that will work for this purpose, but that is my ink that I like to use. And then I'm stamping the leaves from that Lawn Fawn stamp set, Jump for Joy, and I'm doing it four times so that I can make a leaf pile. And I'm gonna stack them up and have this kangaroo jump for joy in his own way and have some fun in the fall. So as I go ahead and color this up, I just want to mention that the supplies that I use are always listed down below in the description box. And they're listed from a few different companies that I like to shop at. And it gives you options to look at different pricing and different places and maybe you prefer to shop at another place over the other place. So you have options. If you are interested in any of these items, definitely check out the links down below for close-ups and more information. And yes, so I'm coloring this kangaroo up. It was so fun to create this idea of the kangaroo. How can I stretch my stamp sets a little bit further? I have this cute kangaroo, this caffeinated kangaroo. I love the caffeinated critters from the rabbit hole designs and it's been a while since I've pulled one of them out and I'm in a fall mood. I'm creating this card series for you. How can I take a non-fall card or non-fall stamp and create a card? So it's fun to come up with this kangaroo's jump. So why not have the kangaroo jump into the leaves and bring that fall vibe to this caffeinated critter? It has been a lot of fun coming up with the the themes and this and the themes and the the cards for um, this series. So I'm excited to see where it goes. I have a few projects that are already filmed and almost ready to go, and I have some more ideas circulating that I still need to film. So stay tuned. I hope you keep watching and keep coming back for this series. I hope you are inspired along the way. If you are, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe because I have more fall videos coming and I'm excited for them. And I definitely do have a Christmas card series coming too. So now that the coloring is all done, here I am stacking the leaves up. It was a little bit off camera here just because the slimline card was not fitting in my in my filming frame because I did it vertically. Usually do it horizontally so that fits better. 
but I used foam tape to stack up all those leaves, give it some dimension, and then I'm using that foam tape on the kangaroo as well. And then I'm going to go ahead and work on the sentiments. So I'm using a few different sentiments. First, I'm stamping the coffee formula doodad from the stamp set. I thought it would be like a fun sun in the yellow area. And then I'm getting my sentiments ready. And then this says, A happy day, fall is here. And that is from the Jump for Joy stamp set from Lawn Fawn. And then this is hashtag bouncy juice. And that is from the Rabbit Hole Designs caffeinated kangaroo. And then you do not see me stamp this. Oh, yep, because it was not working. But caffeine gives me extra bounce. And that is from the Rabbit Hole Designs stamp set as well. And then just to finish off the card, I added some Spectrum Noir glitter from the pen onto the leaves and to the kangaroo just to give it a little bit more sparkle and shine and that finishes off the card thank you so much for watching if you love this video give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and i'll see you in the next one bye for now